Hey guys, it's Hida here. So today we are back, back with another story time segment. Yeah. So if you're new here, please like, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. And you're so much welcome to the family. So today, I have an interesting story for you guys. <laughs> I was a side chick for a whole year. <gasps> so let me tell the story. When I was in my third, no, second year in uh, university, in campus, he was living next to my friend's place. So I went to visit my friend, and then I get, I, I saw him, and then it was really nice. He he looked so cute, you know. Like those guys, you look at them and you're like, damn boy. <laughs> you know, he was really, really cute. He started talking and then after talking, he asked me to date him. And he came a box and we started dating. Yeah, so after that, we dated for quite a while and he was a pretty in interesting guy. You know, that guy you can't even... You can't even shuku that he's he's uh, he's playing you or anything. He was just there like when I call him, he's around. When I want him to come over, he's there. When I want us to go somewhere, he, he he's like down for anything. So he was that kind of guy, and he gave me all his attention every time, and it was just the best. The best five months of my life. The best five months of my life. Oh my God! Wow. Then, uh, when we were six months into the relationship, he started these two tabias, you know, these two tabias that you call him, he doesn't pick up, or you call him and then he picks up and he's like, okay, I'll call you later. And then he doesn't call, so you're like, what is this guy doing? Or you ask him to come and then he's like, no, I am busy. And, you know, he's saying he's busy. Nah. You you know he's, I don't know. You just know he's not busy. You know, that sixth sense. You just know he's not busy. But he used to be like that. So, six months, seven months, eight months, nine months. Uh, the guy is like, um, can I come stay with you at your place? boy no no you can't so uh i told him yeah you can stay over for the weekend but after that you just have to sort yourself out over the weekend he's getting these weird messages and calls you know you don't i don't even know the content but zile message you know he's getting a message and then he he's trying to hide it from you eh. so he was trying to hide it from me so that i don't see and then he's getting these calls he goes outside to pick the call, like Kwanyumba Hakuna Network, <sighs> man, yeah, so he goes outside to pick the call, then it went on like that, he moved, he went back to his place, so this one Sunday afternoon, and I decided to pass by his place, so I went, uh, and I found him, yeah, he was there. We started talking, but he was distant. He's like, why did you come without telling me? I don't know. Stuff like that. And I'm like, simini de miyako, sinafa kukuja. Oh. Eh. See, I'm your girlfriend. I can just come anytime I want. He's like, no. Maybe you wouldn't have gotten me here. Maybe I would have gone somewhere. Maybe I would have been with friends. And then I was like, ah. Boy, nini nimbaya. So cut the long story short hmm. we we hung out that afternoon and then i went back to my place so the next day i don't know something i had i had a problem with my lap no not laptop i didn't have a laptop in campus i had i had a problem with my phone yeah so i decided ah my boyfriend is this tech guy you know boys are tech gurus so i went to his place and then when i get there he's just you know, he's tense, like, he's, okay, so let me fix here, karaka, and then you go. And I'm like, why are you hurting me? Why, why do you want me to go? 
I didn't even know what was going on. He wasn't. I don't know. I I just trusted him so much. Oh, by the way, this guy had a had a child, had a daughter. He became a father when he was in form four. Yeah, so he had a daughter. Ah, uh, yeah. So I knew about the other daughter. So, Mimi Kukuja, this guy is just telling me. He's telling me, go, go, you need to finish up and go, what, 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 what. Now me, I want to stay and hang out because I didn't have classes that day. He, kido, kido, go. So I decided, <laughs> as the good girlfriend I was, I thought I was becoming a wife. I could clean Nyumba and to clean the house. Stop it. Get some help. Shock on shock, my people. Shock. Under the bed, there is a bag with baby clothes yeah not like big baby clothes like some total wow. one week ish doggo you know those tiny clothes tiny yeah so i'm like eh what is this me i know your daughter is four i don't know five years bonus the clothes are for a person who's a week old and he's like no you know those were hers when she was young I'm like, you keep those clothes for four years? Like, yeah. Hey, man. So I told him, eh, hey, say, I can't, I don't know. This is just weird for you to have clothes in your house, maybe clothes in your house. So I went to, I went, I went back to my place. And then he started texting me. And he, you always, you always doubting me. You think I'm cheating on you. You think I'm playing. Well, here's the truth. That house you came to, you always come to, is my, um, who, my what, fiance's house or something, yeah, fiance, my wife-to-be house. We always stay, we live there, and he had, she had gone home for holidays, and she's pregnant, she's almost giving birth, I'm like, what, boy, really, guy, it was stressful it was shocking it's like you've played me for a whole year and you had a girl so meaning by the time we started dating that was when she became pregnant what i'm like wow i've been dating a married man okay he wasn't married technically but he had a wife to be or something yeah he was somehow engaged i don't know here it was just You know those people that you're like, ah, this is the guy. He's just the best. He's always there. Boom. Boom. Just one day. I'm engaged. Mm. My wife is almost giving back. And you're like, oh, God, no. 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 Please, no. 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 Yeah. So I realized I was a sad chick for one whole year. Guys. Guys, the pain, the pain that I felt, what? I was so much invested in this guy. Any, I, I lost weight. <laughs> I lost weight after that. My friends were like, Hidaya, stop. There's nothing you can do. Just let it go. I was telling them, it's been a year. And I thought this was the guy. This was, you know, the guy, the guy, the one, the one for me. I mean, how do you play a girl's feeling for that long? Okay, maybe I was stupid. I don't know. But I wasn't even stupid. I was just trusting him. You know, trusting this man. Giving him my heart, my love. I mean, ugh, it devastated me. Yeah. But anyway, I got over him after like four months. I got over him. Let me sip my tea. <laughs> so, I got over him. And, yes, I am no longer a side chick. <laughs> so, I guess that's it. You guys, when you get into relationships, make sure you do your research. Eh? My girls, I'm telling you, do your research well. Just do your research doesn't matter if they'll say you're a what uh 
you're crazy <laughs> but just do your research because you don't want to end up in a situation where you're a side chick in a relationship you're so invested in emotionally physically financially financially <laughs> you don't want that so yeah that was the story for today mm. uh till next time see i'll see you around guys bye